What's up, Smashers? In today's episode of Chronic Kitchen, we are going to be making infused vanilla ice cream. The first step is extracting our rosin. We took an eighth of flour and we did a two minute extraction at 207 degrees Fahrenheit for 750 material PSI. We got a little over a half a gram of rosin back from this extraction, and we're gonna be placing all of this in our decarb capsule so that we can decarb it and add it to our ice cream mix. Next step is decarboxylating our rosin. To do this, we're gonna plop our rosin inside a small rosin pot and then place that in a small decarb capsule. We're going to be setting our IQ on decarb mode and letting it do its thing for about 25 to 40 minutes until the IQ is completely cooled down. Our next step is heading over to the Chronic Kitchen and preparing all of our ingredients. Then we're gonna cut our vanilla beans so that we can scrape the vanilla out of the center. We like to add the vanilla to the salt because we find it mixes easier in the salt rather than just adding it to our ice cream mix. Then we're gonna mix our cream, milk, sugar, salt, and vanilla together in one pot. Next step, we're gonna separate our egg yolks. Then we're gonna whisk our egg yolks together. Once the egg yolks are done, we're gonna go ahead and simmer our ice cream mixture. Once the mixture starts to simmer, we're gonna take it off of the heat and let it cool for a minute. Once it's cool, we're gonna be adding our egg yolks to the ice cream mixture. Once the egg yolks are added, we're gonna go ahead and add our decarb rosin to the ice cream mixture. We're gonna mix in the rosin until it's fully dissolved into the mixture. Then we're gonna mix our ice cream mixture until the mixture is thick enough to coat the back of the spoon. We are gonna be doing this on medium low heat. Once it's done, we're gonna go ahead and strain our mixture into a frozen bowl. If you have an ice cream maker or kitchen aid attachment, you can mix in there. If not, mixing in a frozen bowl works fine. And then we're gonna mix right away for a few minutes in that frozen bowl. 
and then we'll separate into serving bowls and place in the freezer for at least four hours. Once the four hours is up, we're gonna wash our berries for topping. And then we're gonna serve our ice cream. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe and comment down below if there are any recipes you guys would like to see.